Luke 1, verses 78 through 79, says, Because of our God's merciful compassion, the dawn from on high will visit us to shine on those who live in darkness and the shadow of death, to guide our feet into the way of peace. Zechariah, the father of John the Baptist, prophesied and spoke of how God's plan of redemption was being fulfilled just as God had promised. Now, his newborn son, John, had been chosen by God to prepare the way for the Lord. Through all God was about to accomplish, people would be given the knowledge of salvation and the forgiveness of sin. Rather than living in darkness, God's compassion would shine in the darkness and guide people into his way of peace. What what once was a world full of darkness would be filled with light and hope for those who would receive the message of salvation that was soon going to be declared among them. There is still much darkness in this world because of sin. In fact, we have all lived in this place of darkness and hopelessness. However, God's light has dawned for all those who seek Him and want to find salvation through Him. God has provided a way of salvation through Jesus. Now, He has made it possible to have the knowledge of this salvation through the pages of the Gospel's message. For those, however, who still want to remain in their own sinful ways, God will not force them to change. Yet these must be warned that they will find trouble instead of finding peace. Today's response to hearing God's word is this. Always follow the light. That is, even though you live in a world that is full of darkness, in the darkness of sin, don't settle for darkness in your own life. For this way of darkness only leads to experiencing the consequences of your sin. Recognize that no matter how much darkness is around you, God's light is always visible through Jesus Christ. No matter how difficult following God may seem, know that He is the only way to salvation, forgiveness, and perfect peace. Therefore, you must study God's Word diligently so that you will find and live in God's wonderful light.